Hello, um, Sharon and everybody. This is a an update for using this Wella SP liquid hair restructurizer that I got. Um, there's a trick, <laughs> dead space. There's a trick to using it, and that trick is heat um, heat processing. Let me turn this around. I got one of these little um, heat caps that are used for you know processing hair, obviously, and um, I turn it on high and I use it for about 20 minutes. Um, I put a little um, one of those little plastic processing caps on first. This is what the thing looks like. You know, you just slip it, slip it over your head, real simple. And I'm gonna flip this around. Well, yeah, I am. I'm gonna flip it. I hope you can see me when I flip it. Okay, so anyhow, that. That really seems to be the trick, is the heat processing. I also use about, oh, I'd say five, sometimes six of those pipette things um, on my hair. I put extra at the ends. And so this, my hair isn't completely dry, but it's got that, that feel that it had that first time I used it. The second time I used it, I didn't heat process it. And it didn't, um, didn't seem to to be the same. It doesn't seem to soak in or whatever it's supposed to do. Um, I mean, it made my hair feel soft, but not not like it's filled, like the shaft is filled up the way it feels now. So anyhow, if you're having trouble um, with it or it doesn't seem to be working, do the heat processing. You can also hit it with a hair dryer if you want to. Just you know, put it on your damp hair and then blow your hair dry. Rinse your hair out for 20 seconds and then let it air dry is what I normally do. So anyhow, um, that's what I'm discovering as I'm continuing to use this stuff. And um, I'm still uh, really digging it. You guys have a great day. Bye.